all right so here we are talking about the cool new feature introduced into java 10 which is a var keyword so you can notice that i have a st static int method the return type of this method is int and here i have created three var variables one of the variable stores a string type of data another var type of variable stores a list type of data and here this stores a int type of data which is all valid for a var type of variable that infers the type okay so var automatically infers the type of the variable uh, but very important point about this we have to uh, remember is that var can just be used as a local variable var allows java to automatically infer the type of a local variable at the compile time that means that a var cannot be used as a instance or a static variable like for example if i try and do this i will get an error obviously because var will not be allowed here so it cannot be it cannot act as an instance variable cannot be acting as a class variable that is even if i mark it as static it will not be valid and also one important uh, thing is that since the uh, type of this var is decided during the compile time itself i cannot even initialize null value to this type of variable so you can see that var cannot infer the type for local variable initialized to null and uh, another important point about this var is that if suppose we have the var but we want to know the type of this var what can be done the, if you want to know the type of this var you can simply go for the get class dot get name uh, that tells you the var is created out of what type so in this example the var is created out of type string that means the type of that var is string so we can just get it by using a message dot get class dot get name but one more important thing is that if the var is storing a primitive type of data which is happening in here at this line of code you will not be able to do a get class dot get name because primitives we know that they are simple values they are not the uh, objects so since they are not object they will not have the methods and everything so if i try and do this into data i'll get an error because they don't have that i hope that you have learned something new about this particular concept that was introduced into java 10 that is the var keyword and if you have learned something new subscribe to my channel for more such content